Well, uh, right, so uh, the crash thing happened. Then I started recording, and there's a weird glitch happened. So everything I did. If I did after the crash, it's not recorded. So here we are, guys. Let's ham before we do this match. What is this? Uh, past the hub is this. Just got a bunch of new players here. We're looking at new left backs, I think. Right, let's do this. Biting is a is an embarrassment. We need to play better. Alright, yeah, my cough, not to disturb the thing. Commentary. Oh gosh, what am I supposed to be doing? I'm supposed to be intercepting or tackling them or like what? No, let's stop wasting money in that. Time. I said time. Time is valuable. Well, hopefully, goal is Derek. To be honest, they're looking a little bit light up top. Big expectations on him today. Let's hope he hits the ground. Running. And so the initial 11 for Watford. This is a formation most people in the game are very familiar with nowadays. Yeah, most coaches are adopting this formation. What it does give you is two holding players in front of the back four to protect them, but it also gives you three supporting players to that central striker. And the starting lineup for West Ham United. And the positioning of the forwards particularly interesting. Yes, Derek, the four at the back and the conventional four across the midfield. But the two up front is what I'm looking at. It will become a one with a one behind. And that one behind will be playing in the Teddy Sheringham role. Thank you for attending Vicarage Road. Enjoy the game. And this head-to-head -head confrontation is underway. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Dawson. Daryl Janmat. Not much time to make up his mind. Ball with Cleverly. A goal has gone in at Old Trafford. Let's get the exact details from Allen. It's a goal for Manchester United. It's been scored by Odeon Igalo. The keeper came for a cross, missed it, and left an easy tap in. Six minutes played. And there! And a goal right off the bat. No wonder they're jumping for joy. As we can see, right place at the right time. Striker's instinct is to be there or thereabouts. Keeper has no chance. Well, let's go back to the goal that was scored. Back playing again. West Ham with the advantage. Well, we're sorry for interrupting you there, Alan. To confirm, Manchester United have scored in that match. 
And their lead stands at 1-0 presently. Hassan Diose moving the ball nicely, looking for that final pass. And that's easy peasy for the keeper. News of a goal in the Brighton game. Alan McAnally with details. It's a goal for Brighton and Hove Albion. 15 minutes played. Excellent vision. And it's a goal. Level again. What a match this is turning out to be. So, a level contest. 1-1. One, one. Well, we had to interrupt Alan McAnally just then. Apologies for that. To confirm, Brighton have scored in that match. They now lead by one goal to nil. Pusesso. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Hassan Diose. Hughes. Wonderful tackle. Jared Bowen. It's all about translating. And in with a real chance. He must finish. Well, he saw the whites of the keeper's eyes and the whites of his outstretched gloves. Great goalkeeping. Well, he's denied a certain goal there. Great reflexes from the keeper. Gets his glove on it. Well, body in the way. He's going to be disappointed with that pass. Did have the ball, but not anymore. Saar in possession. Now he must favour the cross. Well, the clearance half-hearted. They're trying to get right into his face. Running towards goal. It looked as though he might have been onside, but he was just a fraction off. Oh, I'm not so sure. I'd like to see that again. Goodness, he was right on top of the situation to get the ball back for his team. That's a very impressive piece of defending. Can they hit on the break? He's in with a chance. And there! Oh, that was a terrific stop in a one-versus-one one situation. Well, high fives all round for the goalkeeper. Absolutely fantastic. Just too close to the goalkeeper in the end, wasn't it? Yeah, poor technique, really. The goalkeeper's not troubled. Well, as you can see, Derek, they're creating plenty of chances, but they're just unable to make it count. They haven't been clinical enough. Surely, though, it's just a matter of time before they find the breakthrough. Wanted to keep it, but couldn't. Offside is the decision. It must have been very closely. Well, yeah, the linesman's got the best view of them all. I think he got that right. Ball's gone. The, the electronic board has been held aloft. Two additional minutes here. This looks promising. Happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. Maneuvering his way forward. Might be dangerous. Will this corner bear fruit for them? The crowd haven't had too much to cheer about for a while, have they, Derek? They need a goal here. He's driven in the corner. And he's fired it against the post. And just the header that was required. The goal they were in search of. Well, it's almost a perfect headed goal. Brilliant delivery into the danger area. Good movement. Back of the net. We might well learn a lot about West Ham and their attitude in the aftermath of that conceded goal. And so it is, the first half story has... should be an enjoyable second half one that is kicked off by West Ham United extremely sloppy in possession Deo Lefeu oh and that challenge carried with it quite the element of risk now what's the referee going to do next 
Well, that hasn't done much to enhance his team's prospects. It is a red card, and you can see what his teammates think about it. Well, you can, but they've just got to carry on with their game. It's not over. Keep doing your things you're good at. It might turn around. And let's get an update from Molyneux, because there's been a goal there. Alan McAnally with the details. It's a second goal for Wolverhampton Wanderers. 48 minutes played, 2-0. Cheers again, Alan. Tremendous ball played through. And a powerful effort, but just lacking accuracy. Yeah, narrowly wide, Derek. Decent effort, he smashed it. Suchek. Jared Bowen. Well, this man will get most of the plaudits for his... An incisive pass. Just unable to take advantage of that developing situation. Suchek. And space for the cross. And there! Classy goalkeeping. Well, it was a good save from the goalkeeper, but you'd expect him to make that save, wouldn't you? Given away. Just a quick reminder, we'll have action from the Carabao Cup coming up live here on EA TV. It's West Ham United against Charlton Athletic. Knockout football, Derek. You... Will he finish? Well, it was straight at the keeper, but technically good goalkeeping. Well, a very big transfer story that we've been covering. And now I can tell you official news coming through. Gabriel Jesus has completed his move to Leipzig. Well, the fee is around £50 million, Derek. That's what I would pay for him. I think he's a really good player. I think he'll add real value to the club. They will now make use of their substitutes bench with Pablo Fornals an unforced error you've got to say Deo Lefeu going well an opportunity with the header but not troubling the goalkeeper at all Lee well I say one thing technique and he didn't have any substitution time it is Carreira Bian Ayeti. I can tell you a goal has been scored at Old Trafford. Who has scored that goal? Alan McAnally. It's a second goal for Manchester United. 71 minutes played. 2-0. Thank you, Alan McAnally. And no problems whatsoever for the goalkeeper. Pablo Fornals. Do you say? Ball with cleverly. Pereira. Speculative ball fired to the near post. And punched away. Ayeti. Only ten minutes remaining here. And it's with Tomasz Suchek. Well, let's get an update from Molyneux because there's been a goal there. Alan McAnally with the details. It's a third goal for Wolverhampton Wanderers. 80 minutes played. 3-0. Alan McAnally with his finger on the pulse. Well, with five minutes remaining and just one goal between them, still the prospect of late excitement in this match. Albian Ayeti. Big chance to get them on terms. It's got to be. Oh, it was a crucial challenge. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. He's got the right idea with that pass. Lack of guile with regard to that cross. Goalkeeper's ball. Oh, he's given it away. Neo Lefeu. He takes aim. And there goes the final whistle. Oh gosh, no.
lost again. Brighton is disappointment. I mean, Watford. I can understand you lose to Watford, but Brighton. Brighton was bad. This, this is understandable. I was playing Reina for his debut, but he played well. 